What is going on guys? JT Gilly back with another video. Today we are in Monterey, California. Now I haven't been here since I was a little kid when we used to go on field trips, so it's definitely been a minute. I've never played out here. I know Brandon's come out here a good amount, so I think it's gonna be okay. There are a lot of water spawns because we're literally on the water. Well, not literally on the water, but right by the water. So I'm assuming the spawns are gonna be pretty good because spawns are usually good by areas with water. Let's go ahead and take a look at the game right now. I did just spin this one, uh, but we have three shiny checks right here that we're gonna go ahead and check out. <laughs> Nothing on the Pat Rat, Puchiana, not a shiny. I feel like we might be able to sneak out a shiny today because a lot of the spawns that I've been checking so far have been shiny eligible, so I'm down for that. We are going to the Monterey Bay Aquarium, which is a pretty nice uh, aquarium that I used to go to all the time, but I don't know if I'm gonna be recording inside. We'll see. I'm excited, I'm excited. I haven't played in a new area in a minute, so this will be fun. Hopefully we can hit some raids, do some research tasks, finish or at least work on our Team Rocket research and just kind of progress throughout our uh, Pokemon Go journey. This is a quick look at the area that we're in right now. Not too bad. It's got a good amount of stops, honestly. Is, there is a Cobalion Raid right there. I should check it. I doubt there's going to be a lot of people there. I might give it a shot, and if I do, obviously it'll be the next clip here, but that's that. Let's see. We actually have a Team Rocket thing to do. Let's go do that. <laughs> okay, looks like we're battling Arlo. We actually need to battle Arlo for our Team Rocket research. We're probably gonna finish the last stage today because the Rocket Radar is back in the shop and I wanted to, and I did, buy an extra one. Uh, I don't know why they go in the shop. I don't know when. I think it's just kind of random, but it's in the shop today. I bought one and we're gonna go ahead and do it so we can continue with the Rocket research and I don't have to do six invasions. It's just gonna buy me some time. Now, I don't remember exactly what Arlo uses, so let me put a squad together and then we're gonna go ahead and take this bad boy down Hopefully it's not as hard as last time because it took us a couple tries. Now, I'm not sure what Arlo is going to be using right now, but we're going to go in with this squad because this is a squad I used to take him down the first time. So I'm hoping he has some of the same counters. I think I think I was supposed to switch this Tyranitar and Groudon. I think I was. Let me do it. 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 Ah, this is a bad idea. It's okay. It's okay. I think we're going to be... Yeah, Tyranitar is going to go in. Okay, so Tyranitar is going to be using the Scyther. Not sure what he's going to use next. Oh, man. I messed up. Uh, this might this might be bad. <laughs> I think we'll be able to clutch it out though because I can tap this Scyther out right now and I can save a Stone Edge for whatever he's got coming up next. Come on. Okay, Scyther has been tapped out. Hopefully he has. Actually, I don't even know what I'm hoping for. He's got Magnezone. Okay, we've battled Magnezone before. We've battled Magnezone before. Let's go ahead and use one of our charge moves so we can get rid of his... I don't know why I'm trying. We can get rid of one of his shields with that one right there. Tap, tap, tap. Hopefully we can get another one off to get rid of the shield and open up Groudon. Yes, okay. Another charge move has been used. Both of his shields are gone. Groudon is gonna come in and absolutely clap him up. Yeah. And then I think we're gonna have a we're gonna have a good time right now, I think. Okay, Tyranitar dad right there. Coming in is Groudon right now. He is hurt a little bit. Ooh, he's actually tapping the heck out of this Magnezone away. Ah, nice. And then down Magnezone is gonna go with this Earthquake. And then we're gonna have two Pokemon to use on the last whatever he's got, so. That's actually really solid. That should take it down. Wow, look at us. Okay. Maybe not as bad as we thought. Scizor is going to come in. We can do some damage. We definitely will deal some damage. We have a free Earthquake. I suck at the ground moves. I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing here to hit an excellent. Maybe this. Maybe what I'm doing right now is working. No. I don't know how I missed, but wow. Got him down to the yellow right there. We're going to tap him. And we're gonna tap him and tap him, tap him, and then Moltres is gonna come in, and he should be able to finish the job. He is pretty gosh darn strong. We do have a shield available, so we can block this. We got a lot of health here. We got a lot of health. We just gotta get one of our moves off. I don't want to use Sky Attack at the moment. I'd love to use Overheat if I can build to it, and yes, I honestly should have just used anything right there, just in case. But we are gonna be able to take down Arlo on our first try. Look at us. Look at us. Okay. Okay, Gilly, I see you. Down goes Arlo right there are another opportunity for us to get a shady Pokemon. I think this is only the fourth team leader battle I've ever done. So I'm actually pretty excited to do this. Down goes Arlo working towards our special research. Thank you so much. He has Scyther, so we could get a shady Scyther right now. That'd be insane. To this day, I've done four leader battles. I've only gotten revives and potions. I don't know why my luck sucks with that, but whatever. Anyways, shady Scyther. Is it possible? It is, but not for us. Not for us. Not at least right now. 600 CP Scyther right here. I'm going to go ahead and quick catch this. I'm just going to hope I catch it. I really don't want to walk all the way back there. Let's check my recents. Yes, we got. All right, 600 CP Scyther, IVs on it. Let's go! That's a hundo, baby. Are you kidding? Man, are you kidding? Yes! Yes, a hundo Scyther from the team Rocket Invasion. That's actually my second hundo Scyther. Um, but, dude, I've done like... 
30 invasions in the past week. I've got nothing over 90, and all of a sudden, all of a sudden, let's go, man, let's go. Another quick hundo for the boy. You know what it is. The last time we got a hundo was, uh, we got a hundo scyther in Japan from a Team Rocket invasion, so this is, uh, this is pretty awesome. What a great start to the day. Just a quick hundo off the bat like it's nothing. I'm down for that, ladies and gentlemen. Bada bing, bada boom. Wow, I guess I gotta max this guy out too. I already have a maxed out Scyther, but this is a uh, maxed out Scyther number two, and I love that he maxes out at 3,000 and, uh, what is it, 3,001 or something like that? Just above 3,000. We're gonna go ahead and max him out, but I just wanna flex that again. Mm, gotta love it, gotta love it. Thank you very much. I'm gonna go ahead and continue to, ca ooh, what? I'm down. Oh, dude, that would've been insane. Well, the spawns here are pretty good. There are some gyms around here, so we might be able to get some raids, and I will continue to do any invasions or anything like that that spawns, but I am uh, I'm loving the way the day's starting. Hopefully, we can continue this fire and have a phenomenal day overall. Beautiful day out here in Monterey. Oh my gosh, I'm all zoomed in. <laughs> I do that so much. Uh, it's a beautiful day out here in Monterey. No crazy catches yet. No, uh, nothing worth recording. Kind of just hanging out, enjoying the day. Because it is such a nice day outside, and I feel like I haven't, dude, I don't know, have I ever done this? Episode? Yeah, I've definitely done it like once or twice, but this is a Pokemon that I just haven't evolved in a while. And I have so many 98% and I have so many 96s. This is a pretty monumental evolution, I think, a little bit too. We're gonna evolve to a Gyarados right now. I have a 98% Magikarp right here. I got a ton of candy, got 3,500 candy. Not that much, but I got a good amount. We are going to go ahead and evolve this into Gyarados. I haven't done a Gyarados evolution in g literal like actual years so this is going to be pretty awesome man wow Gyarados I love Gyarados I don't know why I don't do this well because it costs 400 candy that's why I don't do it too often there it is 98% Gyarados I believe that's my best one no oh no I have a hundo duh I have a maxed out hundo, but there it is, 98%, you know what it is, 1933 CP, as you can see right there, bada bing, bada boom, 15, 14, 15. I thought that'd be a cool little evolution to do, and let's go ahead and do a little bit of an AR action here. Can he pop up? There he is. I don't have AR Plus on, but you can see he's in the water, and maybe, let's just do one picture, let's even get some miracle. Okay, no smear on that, I thought that'd be pretty dope, but uh, yeah man, as you can see, super nice day outside. Beautiful day. I wish there was more to do in game. There are there are a couple stops here, but really nothing crazy, and I don't have time to really sit down and lure it up. I'll try to think of more stuff to do, but we still have to finish our research, meaning we have to do another team leader battle, which hopefully we'll do soon. Kind of wrapping up the day here, we do have a couple of shiny eligible spawns, and wait, what, is that a Galarian Reason we what? A Galarian Weezing raid right here? I thought those were, wait. Oh, that was shiny, but like, um, I didn't know those stayed. I thought that was temporary. Okay. Uh, I know I can't solo it, I don't think. I'm gonna walk over and see if anyone's doing it. I'm down for that, but we do have, oh wait, drowsy check, drowsy check for the one time. I still need that shiny. We do have two rewards to claim. I honestly don't even remember what I did. I think one of them was send 10 gifts. Uh, not a good sneezel right there. And then our other reward is going to give us a, okay, <laughs> I shouldn't have done that. Not much of an adventure here. We only were here for like three, four hours. So I just kind of enjoyed the time and just had some food, which I didn't record, which is, I went, I went here. I went there. I went to Bubba Gumps. Pretty, pretty good. Nothing crazy really happened in today's adventure, but it was a solid grind sesh. A lot of shiny eligible spawns. I figured with so many of them happening and I had an incense up that I might be able to bring in a shiny. Couldn't make it happen. It's all good though. Guess who's back? Yes, ladies and gentlemen, that is correct. We're back, we're back in full force. Videos should be regularly coming out again by the end of this week, and we're getting back into things like nothing ever happened. But before this video is over, I know it's kind of a short one because obviously I haven't been doing any adventures in about a week and a half. I gotta talk to you guys about something super important that I wanna make sure you guys do not miss out on and that you guys make sure you take advantage of because it won't be around for too long. As some of you guys may know, on the day I upload this video, November 26th, Cobalion leaves tier 5 raid so out with Cobalion and in comes a brand new legendary Pokemon from generation 5 that you guys should be super super hyped about because it's gonna be a very very good one in Pokemon Go. Ladies and gentlemen the legendary Pokemon Terrakion comes to raids today from November 26th at 1 p.m. to December 17th so a little bit 
Um, it's kind of like three and a half weeks, something like that. Its catch CP is going to range from 2026 to 2113, and its boosted CP is going to range from 2533 to 2641. Its movesets going to include Smackdown and Zen Headbutt, and then its charge moves are going to be Earthquake, Close Combat, and Rock Slide. Its weaknesses are listed right there. It is going to be a rock and fighting type Pokemon, which is a pretty cool dual type. Its Ray Boss CP is going to be at 48,000 CP, and you're only going to need two to six trainers to take it down. Now, a lot of you guys are asking, why should we care about Terrakion? If it has anything to do with Cobalion, how could it be any good? <laughs> well, ladies and gentlemen, Terrakion is actually going to be the second best rock type in the game. Yes, that means it's going to replace the Pokemon we all love and we all respect and we all have, we all hold dearly in our hearts. It's going to replace Tarmanitar. In order, the top three rock type attackers in this game are Rampardos, Terrakion, and then Tyranitar. So this Pokemon is going to be super, super worth getting. Now let's go ahead and see what Pokemon are best to take down Terrakion in Pokemon Go. The best counters are Mewtwo with Confusion and Psy Strike, Metagross with Bullet Punch and Meteor Mash, Alakazam with Confusion and Psychic, Espeon with Confusion and Psychic, Laios with Zen Headbutt and Psychic, and then Jirachi. Yes, Jirachi is a top attacker uh, or top counter for uh, Terrakion with Confusion and Doom Desire. Pretty much it for this video. I do want to plug something right now. I have started uploading on my second channel. So if you guys are not subscribed to JT Gilly Plays, go ahead and head on over now. Watch the video, subscribe, leave a like, all that good stuff. I'm uploading Pokemon Let's Go stream highlights on there, and it's super, super funny. They're edited down to kind of short videos, anywhere from like 7 to 15 minute videos, and they're super, super funny. I guarantee you guys are going to laugh at least a couple times while watching them. I think they're hilarious, and there's going to be regular uploads coming to that channel as well so make sure you're subscribed to JT Gilly Plays but your boy's back we're back in action the videos will be returning to normal at the end of this week the regular pace you guys see them at the fire coming at you every single day not every single day but you know I, I do my best um, hope you guys enjoyed today's video if you guys did make sure to leave a like and subscribe if you guys have not already hope you guys have a great rest of your day and I'll see your faces soon deuces